Hi, my name is Stephanie Rosine, and I'm a professor of art and the program director of ceramics. I am right now working collaboratively with several chefs in Mexico City and Atlanta, and we are designing clay cooking pots to cook food in. Over three million people today still cook in clay pots around the world, and so I'm working together with these chefs to create um, vessels for them to use in their restaurant application. I've been engaged in this collaborative process with um, several ceramic artists and chefs. What I've been able to do is bring in that experience and those chefs into the classroom, into my dinnerware course, where we looked at not only creating handmade pottery to eat off of, but also creating vessels to cook within. I don't know if I have a go-to cool class example, but I think that one of the things that excites me most in the classroom is when I can collaborate with my students. And so I actually have two students who won a Friedman Prize in Geoscience to actually work with me on this clay cooking project. And they are working with Dr. Zuzana Bala Brunstad in geology to test our ceramic raw materials so that we can design our own clay cooking body um, with materials here in the studio. And so they're really marrying science and art. Our, our program is unique in that we are one of three nationally accredited programs at Hartwick. And what that means is we're held to pretty high standards by the National Association of Schools of Art and Design. And so we're able to craft a kind of small art school environment at a liberal arts institution. So our students go through foundation courses so that they can learn the building blocks of um, two-dimensional design, drawing, 3D, and digital skills. And then they get to move into areas of concentration. Ceramics, glass, printmaking, photography, digital art, sculpture, painting, and glass blowing. And so our students get a really well-rounded liberal arts education, which is about ideas. And then they get the hands-on skills in the studio to marry those ideas to create really powerful artwork. We're showing nationally and internationally recognized artists in our gallery. Our students get to attend lectures by them, have critiques, engage with them. And in some cases, we bring alumni back so students can see how artists make their way through the world and that there are many paths to do so. I think one of the great things that we do in our department is build personal relationships. Because we have small class sizes, we really get a one-on-one -on -one, um, experience with our students, which is not the case at a big art school, right? Um, and so I think that those personal relationships that we develop um, are really imperative in helping our students move on to the next stage of their career. I have never not gone back to school. So I have been either a student or a professor every fall semester of my entire life. Um, I started teaching when I was 24, uh, right out of grad school, and uh, it's a strange thing to, to, I think for a lot of people, to not go back to school. But I have gone back to school every semester since I was five. <laughs>